a lot of people are confused as where can they see all the games that have happened recently so here's a very quick way to get to know like yesterday i know that ali reza played a beautiful game against uh, dominguez so what i would do is i would load up chess base 16 here so this is chess base 16 and on the left hand side i see a live button so i click on it and what it does is it connects to the live database so it connects to all the live games that are being played uh, all the recent games that have been played and you can see that all these tournaments are going on so uh, super bet lotto polish championship barcelona gm nakchiwan open and so on so we are looking at super bet uh, here so this is the database and i can just do control f which is a filter and type firuja so i get all his games here and let's have a look at the game and you will see that the game is also automatically annotated it's an auto analysis that is done it's called tactical analysis if i don't want it i can also right click and delete all commentary so then that is gone uh, and i want to just uh, ask you what move would you play here for white what is the move that firuja played which simply shocked everyone yeah the move here is rook to h7 what a beautiful move because now after uh, king takes h7 there is queen takes f7 and there is no way to prevent rook h1 and this king is toasted so this was a very nice uh, variation and then uh, firuja managed to win this game so that was his first win of the tournament there was also another very nice game between aronian and mvl uh, which is this one and uh, here actually i think somewhere around here the position is interesting but look at this move e5 takes f4 now you can't take this because this would hang uh, so king d2 bishop e6 king c3 and this was a blunder uh, he had to go back and uh, well black was better but not game over but when he went here in came knight a4 the pawn controls this the knight controls these two squares this pawn is not moving and who's going to prevent rook d8 mate no one bishop controls c4 so uh, that was a pretty mate so all of these things uh, you can actually get from this function here which is the live here and you can see all the tournaments that oh in poland this is going on there's also under 14 championship that is going on right now in india which is live so i can see some games uh, uh ilam Parthi is playing uh, drew against arpit bijoy uh, there was a very nice game where mayank chakraborty managed to just win in what 25 moves against uh, his opponent uh, om kadam so these are these features and i hope that uh, this is a feature which will help you in case you have chessbase 16 already please do make use of it and if you do not have it then you can get this one uh, also one small hint to everyone what i would generally do is i would take this game copy it and put it in another database that is my own i won't keep it here because this database keeps updating every single day so it's very good to take and view the games but if you want to save anything then just copy it and you can open up any other database like i can just go to my databases and here i have let's say my my database of uh, some other chess base india important games and i can just uh, paste this here so in this way you will have all your games in one place and all your analysis this is Saga Shah signing off. Bye-bye.